everyone welcome to my october 10 by 10 capsule wardrobe challenge um this capsule is going to be a lot more casual than my past ones because i've had a drastic like lifestyle change i'm doing a lot more studying um going to yoga i'm not working as much so i am at home a lot so there's nothing too fancy here um but i hope that you guys enjoy these october outfits this is the overall vibe I'm going for my boots um and these are the 10 pieces that I will be wearing as you can see I only have one t-shirt but that is because everything else like I'll have a base layer underneath it but it's not really going to be showing so I figured that yeah these would be my 10 items I might wear like a random tank top under that sweater or something like that but I'll walk you guys through the items you might notice if you've been watching some of my capsules for a while that some of these pieces are you recognize well some of them are new so i will show you guys everything that i got um i'm gonna start with this i'm just gonna mention quickly i just washed it so it's still wet so i'm not really gonna talk about it much but it's the organic basics reflex tea um you guys have seen this many 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 times before so i'm not gonna really go into detail um i wear a size medium it's made from organic cotton really really like it love the color love the shape it's just a simple t-shirt with a nice texture these are blendstones and i've been wanting a pair of these for a really long time because i was looking for something in between a sneaker and a winter boot and my winter boots are like tie up and stuff i just wanted something quick easy casual good to wearing to yoga to work on walks and these are honestly so multi-purpose i really really like them i'll link the exact ones that i got down below i kind of do wish i went for more of like the suede ones because i noticed that the leather is just like stretching and you can really see it um but overall like i know that they're gonna last me many many years and i've found them super comfortable they did not i did not need to like break them in or anything so yeah these were definitely an investment but i know that they will be put to good use because yeah they're the only other boots that i have besides my winter boots so um these are the only shoes that i'm going to include in my 10 by 10 october capsule the jacket that i'll be including for the 10 by 10 capsule wardrobe challenge is this new one that i got from tentry if you guys aren't familiar with tentry they are a sustainable fashion brand based in bc and i've been looking for a fleece jacket i was mainly inspired by my roommate because she has a beautiful beige one and it's vintage and i wanted something similar and i found this one it's sustainable it was at a, at a good price i love the green color i think that it just goes with everything in my wardrobe because i feel like i do have some clothing pieces this color but like not a lot so it never really clashes with my other greens um so this is the label here i went for a size medium definitely could have sized down 100 it is very very oversized but i do like it because i can fit like bigger sweaters underneath if i absolutely need to and this has just become my perfect everyday jacket first of all it's super warm um it's casual i can wear it with tights when i go for walks and hikes and stuff but i can also wear it with skirts and i find it looks really really nice so overall i'm super happy with this there's nice big pockets just adds a nice like texture to my outfits the second piece i'll be including is this little lace sweater from brava fabrics they kindly sent it to me i'm not sure if i've included this in a capsule yet but i don't think i have um but this is gonna be perfect on you know those october days that are actually like quite warm um it's a very light cardigan can wear it open can wear it as is and it's made from recycled yarn brava fabrics is a sustainable brand from spain and i do have a few pieces from them um and i've always found that their pieces are really really big so i went for a size small and it's still very oversized i probably could have gone with a xs so that's something to take into consideration if you're considering ordering from them and i do have a discount code um so i'll leave it linked down below um with my code again a newer piece but i've thrifted this frank and oak um pink sweater for like five dollars from renaissance and this is really great on days where i'm not working i'm just studying um i can throw it on the tights before i go to yoga it's just really easy to style i somehow have a stain on it i did not notice that uh i need to wash that before i wear it in my capsule um but yeah it's from frank and oak which i believe is a montreal um sustainable fashion company i could be wrong it could be like toronto but it is canadian and i found it in a size medium yeah it's just overall super nice and i can also warm it up by um adding like a long sleeve shirt underneath it and next if you've been following me for a while you will recognize this cardigan i've included it in many fall and winter capsules um and yeah this one's from poco loco it's an alpaca 
I believe this is called their Cartier Alpaca cardigan and it is so warm, so soft, such a lovely like simple classic shape for cardigan. I love this. I wear it, you know, as a statement piece, but I also wear it um, if I need an extra layer of warmth and yeah, the color is just scream October. So definitely including this in the capsule this year. I'll leave it linked down below. Um, I know that they have some other shapes as well and I, I used to have a discount code. I'm not sure if it's still active, but if it is, I will leave it linked down below for you. I'm just gonna show my bottom pieces on the bed because it's just, yeah, it's easier to get them all in the shot. Um, but these are the new in extra high rise raw hem jeans, which I love. Just a simple blue jean, go with everything. Um, just very casual, simple. You guys have seen these many times before. Then I also have the new in jeans, which are still going strong. They are definitely getting faded and losing their shape a bit, but um, just still waiting to find the perfect jean to replace them. They have a elasticated waistband, so good. If I'm studying all day, it's extra comfy. And then I also decided to include a pair of tights because I am studying all the time or like, you know, studying and then doing errands and then going to yoga. So it just makes sense that I include a pair of tights. These are from TNA, which is Aritzia. And I know it's not a sustainable fashion brand. Um, I'm not perfect. I love Lululemon workout clothes. I've said that many times before. I think that, you know, yeah, they're not the most sustainable brand, but um, they do last a long time. But I was not in the position to afford a new pair of Lululemon tights. Um, and I was in the market for a pair and I definitely wanted a brown pair. I've just been loving this color lately. And so I heard really good things about TNA, but I have to say, well, first of all, they're extra comfy, but they started pilling like right away. Like you can see, it's pretty bad. Um, so I'm not too impressed with that, but I'm definitely gonna wear them as much as I can until, yeah, until they no longer, um, you know, last, um, but oof, yeah, not so great. And lastly, I decided to include a skirt because I love skirts and tights in October. And I threw this on the other day and I really liked it with like sweaters and tights and boots. Um, I've never actually really worn it, but it's secondhand. I found it for like $5. Um, and it is originally from Dynamite. So yeah, just really simple. It will be easy to style with everything else included. It is the first day of the October capsule. So I would give you a little tour of my outfit. Excuse the mess in the background. I am in a rush. I want to film this quick and I did not have time to clean my bedroom before doing so. But this is outfit number one. So I have my Blendstones, which I've been wearing like every day. Absolutely love them. They're so comfy, so easy to style as well. Like they're the perfect like, length of a boot for all of my pants, I find. So these are the new in super high-waisted raw hem jeans, which you guys have seen a billion times. Underneath, I am wearing my Frank and Oak sweater with a little button down and a collar. I am also wearing my Pentry jacket, which I am obsessed with, have not taken off since I got in it. Um, I think that the color is perfect, the length, the oversize is perfect, and I love the texture of it as well. Looks nice with my very like nudie pink yellow A bag, which is a Be Mother company from Toronto. I have my Nord Green watch here. I have a new ring. Um, I was shopping with my bestie so she could get like a necklace for her wedding and I saw this ring and I really liked it. It's from, uh, I don't remember the name, but if I do, I'll leave it linked down below. I thought it was really cute. Necklace is Anna Luisa and these hoops are from Golden. So that is outfit number one. Welcome to today's outfit. Here it is. And like I mentioned when I was showing you guys all the pieces of this capsule, my life is a lot more casual these days. Um, I'm not working as much. I'm doing a lot more studying at home. And usually when I leave the house, it's to go on a walk or go to yoga or go study at a cafe. So tights were a good idea to include, I think. And these ones are from Aritzia. I already told you guys a little bit about them, but I've always wanted a pair of brown tights. I feel like they just like match my wardrobe really well. So brown tights. I'm also wearing these like little purple socks. These are just from winners. They're not like a sustainable company or anything um i have my blundstones on i think that they always look really cute with like a little um sock poking out so that's that my jacket from the 10 tree this is the only jacket i'm including in the 10 by 10 and i don't think i need any other jacket i absolutely love it really cute i'm wearing the same sweater as yesterday um just because it is more of like a casual sweater i think it pairs nice with the leggings i'm not including like base layers in my 10 by 10 because I mean, you don't really see them, but this is just one from Lululemon. 
I've had it for probably like 15 years now. Just really simple, striped, and I'll probably wear it to my yoga class later. Um, and then I have my hat from Globe Hope, which I love. I got this last season. They kindly sent it to me. They're a Finnish company. Um, and I want to get it in the other colors. They have it in like this pink color. They also have it in like a rusty orange. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna get my hands on those this season. Absolutely love it. As for jewelry, I have not worn these little earrings from Anna Louise in so long. They have like a nice little green stone. Um, and then this necklace is new actually. My best friend got it for me um, and all of her bridesmaids at her wedding. And it's just this little like sunbeam and I think it is so pretty. It's actually from Golden where I get a lot of my sustainable jewelry. So it just fits in with all of my other pieces. I love it. I love its simplicity and it's a little sparkle. So yeah, that is today's outfit. Oh yeah, by the way, I forgot to mention, I'm just heading out for a walk. Um, and then later today I'll be heading to yoga. So I thought this would be the perfect fall combo. Welcome to outfit number three or day number three of the 10 by 10. Something different. Well, I'm still wearing these jeans from New Inn. I love these jeans. I think that they're really cute. Um, these are the only shoes I've included in my 10 by 10 for October. So I'm gonna wear them. They are the Blumstones. I'm not gonna explain myself every time, um, but this is the Organic Basics Rib Flex Tea. And a few weeks ago, I spilled toothpaste down it when I was brushing my teeth and the stain never went away which I thought was very strange because it's just like a cotton t-shirt and toothpaste should technically come out. And then I'm wearing my alpaca sweater from Poco Loco which just screams fall in my opinion. I really love the texture of it. It's super super warm. Nord Green um, Native Watch. This is just the one I go to when I'm feeling like I want more of like a classic look. I'm wearing the same golden necklace from yesterday and I'm wearing these golden hoops. So that is my outfit for today. I'll show you guys what it looks like with the next layer. And here we go. Um, same jacket and I am wearing it with my ELA bag. I really like this color combo. Also, excuse my nails. I'm going to get them done on Friday, I think, because they are not looking too hot. It's not focusing, but that's probably a good thing. Um, and I'm actually just on my way to a cafe. I'm going to do some studying. Uh, before heading to work, which is not something I usually do, but I just have a lot of energy today and a lot more time than usual. So yeah, I'm all ready to go. I have a few hours, so might as well go study and grab a nice cup of coffee. Happy Thursday. Here is today's outfit. So, okay, my plan was to wear the skirt because it said it was going to be 19 degrees today, but the weather, it just like took a turn for the worse and it is nine degrees. So I'm really going to bundle up because it's going to be freezing. Um, so I'm wearing my jeans again. Boots. This is my little lace cardigan from Brava Fabrics. I love it. It is boxy, but I like that you can still see like the shape, you know, because I find that boxy things make me look really like frumpy. It's this beautiful like recycled material. It's like recycled yarn. I really, really like it. I'm just wearing a like a base layer that I got from the thrift store the other day. Golden necklace and a Louisa necklace. Anna Louisa earrings today. You can't see it, but the black native watch the same as yesterday. I'm gonna go to a cafe to study before I start work tonight. Um, I'm gonna show you the next layer because yesterday I was really cold with just a sweater and my jacket, so I'm gonna put my other cardigan on as well. Okay, so I've never paired these two cardigans together, but I really like it because of the different like structures, shapes. This one has buttons, this one doesn't, so I feel like it actually like works so yeah this uh sweater is super warm because it's alpaca and then i'm just gonna put on this jacket Ta-da! that is gonna be super warm really perfect and i like that all the sweaters are like thinner so it doesn't look too frumpy or anything oh i'm so cozy today anyways that's my outfit for today i'll see you guys tomorrow okay i'm trying to fix like the lighting situation so you guys can see my outfits better i think it's better with the curtains closed um, yeah, actually, you can see my face. Um, so this is today's outfit. It's the same as the other day. Um, it's my day off today. And so I'm going to a yoga class. I'm going to go get my nails done because they look horrible. And I'm also going to run some errands 
and do lots of studying. So hence the tights. Um, today I'm also wearing my alpaca socks, which I think I mentioned. I love these socks. My dad got me them for Christmas last year and I wear them whenever I can. They are so warm, super, super comfy. Um, and then I'm wearing the same sweater I did last time I wore the tights. So this is secondhand Frank and Oak. I found it at any cell, so it just has a cute collar and some buttons and same jacket and purse as always. And yeah, that is my outfit for today. I am also wearing my S necklace today. This is from Ana Luisa and my little hoops are from Golden. I think I mentioned this before. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this before, but basically the hoops came with this pearl um, on each of them. And one day they just kind of like, you know, fell off. I didn't know that they were they were removable. Um, so sometimes I wear them with the pearl, obviously not to yoga. Um, and sometimes I just wear them as the hoop. So it's kind of like a two in one. And I really do like their jewelry. It's all sustainable and stuff. So I'll leave it linked down below if you're interested. This Sunday morning, I'm off to a yin yang yoga class. I've done this one once before and it was really, really hard. Um, and I figured it was early. I was up early enough today, so I figured I would go. This is my outfit, same as the other day. So I have the Frank and Oak sweater, ten tree jacket, the tights. Um, I'm also gonna go to a coffee shop and study for a few hours. So yeah, this is gonna be perfect. And because it is like a yin class, I'm not gonna be like super sweaty. Um, alpaca socks and my boots. Earrings are from Golden. Sorry, I just woke up. My voice is a bit like groggy. <clears throat> S necklace because this one is short enough to wear to yoga I find. Um, then I got my nails done the other day. This is the color I went for. It's a little bit more rosy than the color I had before. Oh, I didn't talk about my rings. Okay. Well, this is the only ring that I'm wearing today. It is from the brand Monica Vinegar. They sent me over three rings and they are a sustainable jewelry company. I think that this ring is gorgeous. This is the one I'm wearing today because the other ones are a little bit more chunky and have like a stone and it's just not great for yoga, but this one I don't really take off. I really like the look of it, um, especially with my nail polish. So yeah, that's a new sustainable jewelry company that I got to try out and I really like it. I'll leave it linked down below and I also talk about it a bit more in a blog. Here is today's outfit. It's finally warm enough. I can wear the skirt. I've been waiting for so many days. So this is just a skirt. Um, it's black and silky. I'm not sure if you can really see the detail of it, um, but it is originally from Dynamite. I found it secondhand for like $8 and I never really wore it until a few weeks ago and I just like randomly put it on with this outfit and I thought it looked really cute. Very flattering. It's a nice length, not too long. And I'm just wearing it with my Swedish stocking tights and my bloodstones, of course. And I just have this secondhand like, little white long sleeve shirt underneath, it's just cotton, and my Brava Fabrics cardigan. And I think it looks really cute together. I'm just going to work, so I'm going to take it off when I get to work anyways, but still, at least I get to wear it. I think it looks cute with my nail polish as well. Um, I'll show you guys my rings. So this one is from, I think it's Magpie. I'm pretty sure that was the name of the jewelry store that I got it from. Um, these two here are Monica Vinader, and then this one is from Ana Luisa. I've just been loving wearing a lot of rings lately. Same necklaces as before, and my golden hoops, and I'm just wearing my Nord Green black watch again. I do have a gold watch um, from them, and I think I'm gonna find a screwdriver so that I can make it looser, because the only reason why I don't wear it is because it's too big, but I feel like it would have looked really cute with this outfit. I'll show you guys what it looks like with my jacket. Oh yeah, also I wanted to show you this is the packaging that the rings from Monica Vinader came in. I also got this one which is really really pretty. The only thing is it kind of sticks out because of the stone and I'm just worried that it might get ruined at work whereas the other ones are like much more flat and I think they'll be okay. Whoops. And here we go with the jacket. I think it's like the perfect length because you can kind of see it peek through. I'm going to wear it obviously with the same purse I've been wearing from ELA, just like the nude colored one. So yeah, this is my outfit. Okay, it's a little bit dark because it's almost six o'clock. Is my day off. Stayed in my pajamas most of the day. I did go for a run um, and a walk, but yeah, so I'm showing you guys my outfit now. I'm just about to leave for yoga. It's nothing special. 
my jacket, my purse, my tights, my boots like usual, and over this workout tank top I just have my alpaca cardigan. Yeah, it was like 24 degrees today, which was really nice, but I think it's gonna cool down after my yoga, so I want to make sure that I'm nice and warm, so I'll see you guys for tomorrow's outfit. Welcome back to another outfit. It is... No, it's not Friday. What day is it? Wednesday. I am heading off to work. I completely forgot that these pants were even in my capsule. So, um, yeah, wearing them today. And since I didn't have a wild card, I decided to wear my sneakers. I don't know what that is on the ground. Um, because it's 23 degrees today. And even when I leave work, it's going to be really, really warm. So I figured I'd skip the boots today. Um, feeling very bloated. So yeah, I'm happy that these have an elastic because I'm going to get my period soon. Um, then I'm just wearing the little cardigan because it is the lightest sweater that I have in this capsule and I put my organic basics pink ribbed tee underneath Matches the nude color purse from ELA jewelry today. I'm wearing these bigger hoops from Ana Luisa This necklace is from Ana Luisa. I'm wearing the gemstone one today from um, Monica Vinader and I'm hoping that it stays on because I'm realizing I think I got this one in a size bigger Just to see if it would like fit better, but I'm definitely a 7.5 like these ones so i should not have gotten an 8 for the gemstone one and then these ones are also from monica vinader so that is the full outfit today oh yeah and then i'm obviously like it's warm but i will just be carrying my jacket because i don't think i need um to wear it so like i said it's 23 degrees we have a crazy indian summer at the end of october <laughs> I believe that this is the last outfit of the October 10 by 10. So here it is. I don't think I've done this combo yet. So my jacket, obviously. And I'm wearing the Frank and Oak secondhand sweater that I got with a little button down and collar. I'm wearing my elasticated new and jeans, the boots, and the bag. And that is my last outfit today. I'm actually off. Um, but I did wash my hair. I'm just gonna leave it straight. I'm gonna cut it next week, I think, because it's getting really ridiculously long and it's starting to look a bit stringy. So yeah, it is time for cut. But for jewelry, I'm wearing these Ana Luisa little gemstone hoops, little stone hanging Ana Luisa chain, Monica Vinader ring. I love the look of these rings. Sorry, the gemstone is like not centered. Um, That one is a moonstone apparently, so it's like, it kind of looks like an opal, but it's clear, but there's like a hint of pink in it. Anyways, I really like it. it looks really cute. And yeah, that is my outfit for today. I am about to go to the bank, then I'm going to go study at a cafe for a few hours just to get out of the house. Um, and then I am going to pick up some fruits and vegetables on the way home. So just running some errands today, taking it really, really easy. So yeah, that is it for this video. I hope that you guys liked my October 10 by 10 and if you did, please like, subscribe, and comment down below if you'd like to see a November 10 by 10 as well. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!